quick glimpse of today's work crew <coughs> doing work all over the farm. You can see we just moved the hot tub over here. That's eventually going to become the one of the aquaponic systems. Here's our sweat lodge all covered in blankets because we just did a sweat the other day. Truck beds that are all being turned into garden boxes. And new garden boxes everywhere. Oh, you can also see all the pallets that have been donated recently. And the stack of lumber over here that's been donated that's going to be used to help build the greenhouse. And those greenhouse sides. I don't know if we're actually going to use those greenhouse sides, but we at least used them for models of what to do in the future. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, oh wow, new development. Salamander claws. <coughs> he has one, two, three, four fingers. Four little fingers. <laughs> I want to go set him free in the garden. Go for it. Farms. Earlier in an update, we saw our wonderful little Brussels sprout babies in those little cups. Well, we put them into this little bucket, had them grow up a little bit longer, and now we're finally getting them outdoors and plant them down in the air. This new trammel box just got made today. Now, these are dwarf Brussels sprouts, so they will not get that tall, so that's why I can plant them so close together and it's such a shallow box. If they were full Brussels sprouts, you'd need probably a whole foot in between each plant and a much deeper box. You probably hear the rototiller still going over there. That's part of our new greenhouse project that we're doing. It's gonna be Probably a video in the next month or so because we're going to do it once the whole project is done and show you how we did it from start to finish. for watching a new box get made. We'll probably get some lettuce or something else to go in here in the center. And then some onions spread in between. Thank you very much for joining us at Manibu Farms.